Hey, and welcome to this video on the Coach Whip Snake. Please subscribe for more amazing content. And for more information on this, check out the link below in the description. The Coach Whip is a member of the Whip Snake genus. These are very long, slender, non-venomous snakes native to the Americas. Because of how common they are, it is easy to accidentally come across one in the wild. Fortunately, they pose little danger to people. 5 Coach Whip Amazing Facts the reproductive season of the coach whip usually takes place in the late spring and summer months. Females may breed with several different males during this period. She will then lay up to 24 eggs in a small burrow, although the average number of eggs is just 11 eggs. It takes them more than two months for each baby to hatch on its own. The coach whip is among the fastest snakes in the Americas. It has a maximum speed of about 4 miles per hour. The coach whip tends to live about 13 years in the wild. The maximum age in captivity was recorded to be about 20 years. Coach whip snakes maintain a small home range that they use for hunting. In the breeding season, male snakes will defend this location from rivals to protect any females within it. All sorts of myths have arisen around the coach whip. One myth is that they have the ability to whip a person to death with its tail. Another myth is that they will suckle the milk from cows and other mammals, leaving the young baby calf without any milk. These myths are completely false. Where to find coach whips? The coach whip is very common throughout the southern United States and northern Mexico, from the Pacific to the Atlantic coast, although apparently not around the Mississippi River. They prefer areas with loose, sandy soil, including prairies, coastal dunes, open pine forests, sand hills, and fields. These snakes are most active during the hottest hours of the day. When it's nighttime or cold out, they will typically seek refuge in underground burrows or beneath objects. During the winter, they do hide hibernate for extended periods to conserve energy. There are six recognized subspecies, each with its own geographical range. The eastern coach whip lives as far north as Missouri and as far south as Florida. It's also bounded by the Atlantic in the east and Texas in the western part of its range. The western coach whip lives as far south as Mexico City and all the way north to Nebraska. It's also bounded by New Mexico in the western part and Texas in the eastern part of its range. The Sonorian coach whip can be found in a small region between Arizona and Sonora, Mexico. The San Joaquin coach whip is found around Northern California. The red coach whip lives between Southern California and Arizona. Finally, the Baja California coach whip is found in that respective peninsula of Mexico. Coach whip scientific name. The scientific name of the coach whip is Mastichophis flagellum. Mastichophis is derived from two Greek words, mastix meaning whip and ophis meaning snake. Flagellum comes from the Latin word flagrum, meaning whip or scourge. This is actually a common biological term used to describe many whip-like appendages on a variety of different organisms. Coach Whip Population and Conservation Status According to the IUCN Red List, the Coach Whip is overall a species of least concern, but habitat loss and road accidents are responsible for a slight decline in numbers around some areas. The state of Illinois, for instance, lists it as an endangered species within its borders, but they are quite plentiful in the core of its territory, including Texas, Florida, and Arizona. How to identify coach whips, appearance, and description. The coach whip is a long, slender snake that has the capacity to reach up to 8 feet in length. They are characterized by a small head, large eyes, and a scale pattern that resembles a braided whip. The coloration is probably the easiest way to identify them. The skin is black or dark brown around the head and slowly progresses to tan or white around the tail. The exact range of colors varies across subspecies and locations. The red coach whip subspecies features dark red or pink hues. In Georgia and Florida, the coach whip is almost completely tan, and the Sonoran coach whip has black bands interrupted by smaller red bands. There are few differences between males and females, but the juvenile or baby coach whips are generally tan or brown with white spots on the snout. Here is how to identify the coach whip. Extremely slender body, 3 to 8 feet in length. Small head with large eyes. Scale pattern resembles a braided whip. Colors range from black or dark brown on the head to tan or white at the tail. Coach whip, how dangerous are they? 
Coach whips are not very dangerous at all. These are non-venomous snakes that generally defend themselves by standing up and biting. Although the bite can cause pain and swelling, the snake also has the tendency to tear away its skin. It generally goes away after a short time. There are no long-term complications unless the wound becomes infected, so it's always a good idea to wash the wound out with soap and water to prevent this from occurring. If the wound looks more serious, then you may want to contact a doctor. Because of its speed, agility, and size, the coach whip has few natural predators in the wild besides maybe coyotes and great horned owls. Coach Whip Behavior and Humans there are a number of old myths associated with the coach whip that persist to this day. Some people believe it will chase after you and attempt to whip you with its tail out of self-defense, but this is completely false. If threatened, they will attempt to run away and hide. They will try to flee back to their underground burrow or even climb up trees. If cornered, they may try standing up and biting at their harasser. Coach whips are active hunters that go looking for food in the daytime and attack with their impressive speed. However, they use neither venom nor constriction to subdue prey. Instead, they strike out and grasp prey in their jaws, swallowing it alive or dead. Like all snakes, the coach whip has the ability to capture odor particles directly from the air by licking with their tongue and then pressing the particles against an organ in the mouth. This helps them hunt for prey. The diet of the coach whip primarily consists of small lizards, rodents, frogs, insects, birds, and eggs. Thanks for watching this video on the coach whip snake. If you want to give your opinion, please comment below. We'd love to hear what you have to say. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button. We will see you next time.